If you want to make this necklace in the next 10 minutes, you just drop everything else and let's get started. the one in charge with your tutorial today. So I will give you some designer tips along the tutorial. Keep watching. Let's get our supplies and make that necklace now. For the first easy version of this necklace, we need to use three 11 -0 colors and then you can extend really the sky is the limit of how many colors you want to use as long as you learn the basic uh, technique. So for this pattern we have two items would be one the bridge that always has the same color and then the flower that changes the color and we can change the color of the circle and the center of the Piece. So, let's start with eight seed beads in the color that you want for the first flower. Two, four, six, eight. So here we have eight seed beads. We close them in a circle, just leave yourself a good tail and go back up two the first two. And now we decide what color we want the center to be. In this case let's say that we want this um, yellow. We skip one, two, three and go from down up through the fourth and this is our first flower. When we finish the flower, we immediately start with the bridge. The bridge comes with upper bridge and uh, bottom bridge. So for the upper, we pick up the color of the bridge, the color of the next, the color of the next um, circle of flower, and then again the bridge. So bridge, next flower bridge, and we go down through the very next seed bead from the previous color. This was the upper part, and for the bottom part we need bridge and the next color. And we go up through the color of the next flower seed bead. And here we already have the two color two seed beads from the next circle. Now, for the flower, we have the upper part, the bottom part, and for the upper part, we pick up three seed beads in the color of the flower and then one in the color of the uh, center. So three flower one center and we go back down through the second seed bead like this so this is the upper part and now we work on the bottom part that is made out of three seed beads in the color of the flower. And then we go back up through the seed bead that is after the center. And we just tighten the thread. And this is our flower. When we finish the flower, guess what? 
we do the bridge. And for the bridge, we have the sequence of color of the bridge, the color of the next flower, and again, bridge. Go back down. For the bottom part, we have the color of the bridge and the color of the next flower. And we go back up. the color of the flower tighten the thread and the bridge is finished we have one two three vertical colors of the bridge and now we continue with the flower the color of the flower of the circle we need three seed beads and one the color of the center and we go back down the second one and now we work on the bottom of the flower which is three seed beads and go back up through the first seed bead same color and here is how it looks like with three basic color. Now let's start on our bonus part of our tutorial and we will introduce a fourth color. So here we have the bridge and we have bridge the color we want for the next flower bridge and we go back down like this this was the top of the bridge and now the bottom which is bridge and the next flower when we have three vertical in the same color the bridge is finished so we start the new flower the first part of the new flower is three seed beads in the color of the flower and one which is the center and go back down the second flower seed bead and the bottom is made up of three seed beads in the new color and we close the circle by going up through the seed bead after the center and here is how we have introduced easily the fourth color after the flower is finished we continue with our bridge so bridge the next color, let's consider that we want this one and the bridge. Go through the very next one after the seed beads where the thread comes out. This was the bottom, the, the top. And now for the bottom we need the color of the bridge and the color of the next flower. The bridge is finished and we continue with the flower and for the flower we have three seed beads for the flower circle and now you can decide what color you want for the center and let's say that we want this one then go back down through the second flower seed bead and now the bottom of the flower we just add three seed beads in the color we have chosen go back up through the first seed bead after the center 
and really from here you can decide on how many colors you want to use and what is the combination that you want to do with the center. This pattern is very fast. You can make a necklace that is very short right around the base of your neck or a very long one so you can wrap around the neck a few times and yeah it's really up to you what colors you want to use and I hope is a very nice pattern for the springtime don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell button so you know when I put up the podcast.